Hello everyone, this is Ben from The Gaming Master, and welcome to my very first series on my new YouTube channel. I thought I'd start off with LEGO Star Wars The Complete Saga for two reasons. Number one being, I'm a big fan of anything related to Star Wars. And number two, this is the first video game I ever played, all the way back when I was like three or four or something. So yeah, I do have a lot of good memories with this game. Uh, so yeah, since it was the first game I ever played, I thought, hey, why not play it as the first game I do on my YouTube channel? Uh, so yeah, that's what we're going to be doing today. So let's go ahead and start off a new game, shall we? So let's see here. We got Qui-Gon and Obi-Wan Kenobi. So we're going to be starting off with episode one, because I believe that's the only one that's available to us yet. So you might be wondering, hey Ben, if this is the complete saga, then where's 7, 8, 9? And this game, I believe, came out in 2007, I believe. So yeah, the sequels didn't even exist. So yeah, that's why there's only one, two, three, four, five, and six. So I'll give you a brief uh, tour of the cantina here. So over here, once you collect enough coins, you can actually buy some characters and some ships and all that cool stuff. And then over here, you can actually create a custom character. So that's pretty cool. Uh, maybe we'll mess around with that in a future episode. And then over here is for like the side mission stuff, but for this series we're just going to be focusing on the main storyline. So this should be a 36 part series as there's 36 levels. So the idea being that we'll do one level per video. Uh, so yeah, that's pretty much what we're going to be doing to, uh, excuse me, in this series. Uh, but first, let's finish this lovely R2-D2 mural. Excellent. Boom. And we already got some nice coins. Alright, so let's hop in to the very first level of LEGO Star Wars. Chapter 1, Negotiations. Episode 1, The Phantom Menace. Chapter 1, Negotiations. I'm already getting a lot of nostalgia from this game. Turmoil has engulfed the Galactic Republic. With a blockade of deadly battleships, the Trade Federation has stopped all shipping to the small planet of Naboo. The Supreme Chancellor secretly dispatched Jedi Knights Qui-Gon Jinn and Obi-Wan Kenobi to settle the conflict. Oh, only two paragraphs? Okay. Most Star Wars openings are three paragraphs, or at least in the movies at least. Alright, starting off with negotiations. Here we go. I watch the original trilogy all the time, but it's actually been a while since I've seen uh, the prequel trilogy. <laughs> so I may forget a few things in these movies. Oh, here we go. Qui-Gon and Obi-Wan. Then a silver C-3PO. I forget what his name is. Oh, boy. Okay. Alright, here we go. So we can either play as uh, Obi-Wan or Qui-Gon here. I might stick with Obi-Wan simply because blue lightsabers are my favorite. Oh, let's see, what else do we have in this room here? Can't you use like the force on the chair? Yeah, and then the cantina music plays. Well, I'm kind of surprised I remember that. Normally I play this game uh, every couple of years just for fun, but it's been a little bit since I've played this game. I believe the last LEGO game I played was actually a LEGO Star Wars game, uh, but it was the Skywalker Saga. Alright, oh, we got droids here. Let's take them out. And then we can also force choke them. That's pretty funny. So yeah, all of these rooms over here, this is actually side quest stuff. So if you guys want me to see- if you guys want me to do the side missions, let me know in the comments. And I mean, maybe I'll do them, but this series is more targeted for... Just the main story. Alright, we can kind of... Aw. Uh, I'm trying to, like, reflect the laser back at the droid. Come on. Oh, yeah, I can't angle it. Whatever. We can just take him out. That works, too. What's over here? Oh, so this is... So some of the side stuff you have to do on free play. Because right now we don't have R2-D2, obviously. All we have is this silver... Uh, C-3PO guy. TC-14, okay, that's his name. So we can actually activate this door with him. Yeah, so whenever you see a picture over here, try to find this character. And then they can actually open up doors and stuff for you. Uh, so that's pretty cool. Let's see what else. Oh yeah, we can collect some coins. 
by force lifting these things. We got some hearts. Let's see, how do we get through this one? Oh, okay. We gotta build this. And then let's grab TC14 again. Alright, we're now in here. Let's take our boy Obi-Wan Kenobi here. What happens if we explode these? There's just a bunch of coins. Fine by me. I'll take some coins. No, I feel like I kind of rushed this part, so let's actually go back for a second. I just want to make sure I didn't miss anything. Alright, so we got some more coins to collect. But yeah, I believe all of these rooms off to the side, those are... Like, pretty much only for free play. Because, like, that one room you couldn't even open unless you had R2-D2. Uh, which I don't believe you get in this level. So, just getting some coins here. Nice, nice, nice. Alright, that's probably pretty good. Let's go back. And, uh, let's see what's next. Come on, guys. What do we got here? Alright, so we're gonna use the force on this. Oh, yeah, I forgot to mention at the start of the game. Oh, okay. Hold on. Alright, that scared me. Uh, I forgot to mention at the start of the uh, video, I'm actually playing on the Nintendo Wii. So, yeah. <laughs> Alright, now we got power up. Can we one tap him? Yeah, we can. We can. Just with one swipe of the saber, we can take him out. That's awesome. Alright, come here, buddy. Boom. So I believe that this room above me is for red bricks. So I think somehow you like use the force on these blocks and then you can get a red brick up there. So yeah, like I said earlier, if you want me to do some of the side stuff, by all means let me know. And once we finish the main story, I might uh, go on ahead and do that. Alright, so we got these guys over here. Oh boy. Let's take these guys out. That was a cool attack there. Alright, so I forget how we take these guys out. Do we literally just go up to them? Or can we somehow like reflect the lasers onto them? Oh. I forget how to do that. Here, I'm just gonna go for him. Oh, well, that worked. <laughs> oh, shoot, he got me. Dang it. There we go. Come on. And there we go. So yeah, you can kind of use these videos for two ways. One, you can just watch them for fun, but also if you're playing along with, I mean, feel free to use these as a guide if you get stuck on a certain part. Well, you can go on ahead and do that. All right, so what's this over here? Can I build something? Oh yeah. Okay, surely this is here for a purpose, right? <laughs> it actually might be a side thing. Oh, I'm surprised we could make that jump. Okay. Can I get that blue coin? Really? You're going to tease me with it? There's no way Qui-Gon's a higher jump rate. Right? Yeah, okay. Right. Can we do anything else with this? I don't think so. Alright, so we can use the... Alright, what's this do? Alright, never mind. Anyway. Here we go right here. Here's what we need to do. We need Qui-Gon to jump on the other one too. Alright. Now we stand on these buttons here. Oh, forgot about this. We need to take out more droids. Come here. I'm just gonna use the force on this guy. Nice. Alright, now we take 3PO. All right, keep calling him 3PO. TC14. Let's store a little thingy majig over here. And boom. We have successfully completed the first level. In our Lego Star Wars adventure. <laughs> there it is, level complete, free play unlocked. Looks like we got a gold brick there. I kind of forgot that you got gold bricks literally by just playing the levels. Uh, so yeah, we have a lot of characters to collect throughout our adventure here. Uh, some of them are like... You can buy them with coins in the cantina like I showed you at the beginning of the episode. But a lot of them you just unlock by playing. Oh, so yeah, that was the first part in our LEGO Star Wars adventure. Level complete. One gold brick. 
And I think you also get gold bricks by getting true Jedi, which is by, uh, you can obtain by collecting a certain amount of coins. So yeah, that's gonna be it for the first episode of our series. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you did enjoy and you'd like to see more episodes, definitely leave a like. And let me know in the comments if you'd like to see me play some of the side missions. I could definitely do that. I forgot to mention, but this is actually the first game I ever got 100% complete on, too. Uh, so I do have some knowledge on the side stuff. So if you guys want me to make some videos on that, by all means, let me know and I could do that. But yeah, if you guys want to see more episodes, don't forget to subscribe, and I'll talk to you guys later. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.